what is going on gamers avatrix here and today we're going to try and solo wretched gorge 3 so we have tried this a few times and my conclusion is that this is the probably the best team to use um for myself anyways everybody has revive on here uh santa boom i was a little iffy on because he sometimes would kill the pumpkin duke stacks but at the end of the day, he just brings so much damage that it's kind of hard to turn him down. So we're just basically hoping for the right spawns. Maybe like the big bosses to spawn right behind me. That way I can get some stacks going. And the demons to to get summoned really far away. But, uh, you know, those are pretty, pretty much just waiting for the right wave. That's, that's just what it comes down to it. There goes Santa Boom. Boom. You see? And that's what I'm talking about. Now I have... No energy to go into this one. Well, not no energy. I got energy. But what I don't have is Pumpkin Duke stacks, which is crucial. All right. So Santa Boom just went off once again. Uh, okay. This one looks like we're going to be good. Here comes a demon, which can be a little troublesome sometimes. Okay. I got a heal off. Oh, Vlad is dead and a Pumpkin Duke proc for them. Yeah. If a Pumpkin Duke procs for them... um. That pretty much just, just means that it's over. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, they're already strong enough. And then you get a Pumpkin Duke proc. This is not going to be too good for you. All right, well, let's see what else we can do in this one. Let's see if we can monster something. Uh, we just need that. We needed that spawn, but not the demon. We needed the the bosses, the centaur bosses. To be on that wave that spawned right next to us. We needed those demons to be like over here or something like that. But I digress. That's pretty much what I'm looking for here. Alright. We're getting our energy up. Cupid is going to get our energy up. Ares. I mean Ares really for the most part is pretty much almost a waste I guess you can say. Just because he only targets so many. Like five. That he could be kind of wasted until... Ooh, this is pretty much what I needed. This is what I needed. This is what I needed right here. I needed those bosses to stack right on top of me. Oh, this is the one. This is the one. I just I just need to not die. I just... And not get stunned. That'll also go a long way. Oh, Gulam is helping me. Gulam is helping me. Gulam is helping me. Please, guys, get up. Get up, get up, get up. Oh, yes. Okay. Pumpkin Duke is in there. Pumpkin Duke is in there. My Ares is in there. My Golem is there in case that happens. And now it's going to be a DPS fight. That's pretty much as... Am I going to have enough time to clear this boss? It's really... Ah, oh, I thought Ares was going to help more, but he's still stunning me way too much. Ah, oh, I, I, I need... I need him to not stun me, right? Oh my god, and he's doing a lot of damage to my hero bases. That is a problem. Every time he stuns me, he does so much damage to my hero bases. No. And it, it looks like I'm not even going to be able to get done. I need to... S okay, so essentially, Ares really is, is no good. Because even though he disables him... He's he's not disabling him enough to actually matter. He's still getting his stun off. Oh, okay, so we're going to have to rethink Ares. I mean, Frost Witch? But that would be crazy too because, yeah, my hero bases are dead. Even if I had a lot more time, the hero base would just die. I'm going to have to rethink my strategy here. My hero bases are dead. Next proc. Oh, man. Man, oh, man. Santa Boom is definitely not a bad choice, but I think he's going to have to go. He's going to have to go. I need another debuffer in there. Somebody that's going to slow him down. Mm, or prevent the stuns, for instance. He would... <laughs> I'd hate to do this, but I think I'm going to have to use my Frost Witch. Ain't that some crazy stuff? 
can she even survive? <laughs> oh, man. That's... Okay. We're gonna have to try it out. She's got Scatter. She's gonna slow him down. Oh, my God. This is, this is gonna be dependent on Vlad for the most part, which is, which is bad. But Ares... And my Ares is 10 of 10 skill. That still wasn't enough. Roswitch, are you the answer? But now the only problem that I fear is that I don't have enough damage to be clearing the waves. Oh, man. It's either Vlad or Bust. Because Gulon, he does damage, but he doesn't clear waves like Vlad does. So this is going to be interesting. We're solely relying on Vlad clearing waves right now. Which is kind of a bad thing to rely on. <laughs> I mean, look at Frostwitch. She's, she's over here like, yeah, I can be a good hero too. I can be legendary. I have a statue. Yeah. Oh my, I'm so sorry. Can she live that though? Is she even alive? Oh. Apparently she is. Who would have thought? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What the heck just happened? Oh no 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 don't die don't die don't die don't die don't die don't die. He died. He died. He died. Yeah, I don't I don't have enough damage. Cross switch is not the answer. I just don't have enough damage. Hmm. Harpy Queen. Let's give Harpy Queen a shot. Is she in one of these towers? Yep. Okay, so Harpy Queen can be a debuffer like, like her. And I don't know if she provides any more damage, but it's a worth a shot. She's a debuffer, which will go a long way. Uh, maybe Multanica might have been a better option because Multanica's debuff is way longer and probably better. Doesn't have multi randomly targeting like her, but it can clear a wave with some stacks. Uh, we might have to try Multanica after. We'll see. We'll just have to see. We'll give the old Harpy Queen a shot. Oh my. That's unfortunate. Didn't see that coming. Well, actually, this helps me get Pumpkin Duke stack, so when that happens, it's not necessarily a bad thing. Huh. That is interesting. I actually don't mind another one like that, because it gets my Pumpkin Duke going. I don't kill them fast enough, but they don't have enough damage, and I have the shield to protect me, so I actually don't mind those spawns. And as soon as I say that here, they all come. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Where is... Oh, my Vlad is dead. That, that's that's game. Oh, man. Okay, Multanica it is. Okay, of course I have Multanica in the tower. Because why not? Alright, Multanica it is. We'll see what Multanica does now. Because the, the other teams, I'm pretty sure. I mean, that's probably the best combo. I'm just iffy on that last hero. Santa did its job, but then the Ares Disable just wasn't enough. It just wasn't enough. Hmm. It has to be a debuff. For Frost Witch would be perfect, but that's too much of a load on Vlad alone to carry all the damage. And I forgot to put Revival on Multanica. Eh, that's okay though. He's got Scythe Shield, so he might be able to withstand the stuns. And keep debuffing him, which is not a bad thing, actually. And by him, I mean the demon. The stun demon. That's really the only one that gives me issues. What are, what are we doing right now? My base is getting destroyed. Hello? Hello? Yes. They're destroying my base. Hello. Yes, do something, please. Thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate you. Oh, man. Why did you have to... Why did you... Why? Why all the way over there? Why couldn't you spawn right behind me? 
like a good person would have. That's just disrespectful. Okay, I got the stun on that one. And I am getting absolutely destroyed. Yeah, yeah, I got destroyed. Oh my god, man. It's just not good enough. It, it's... I need a debuffer. Ares, the disable is just too strong and it lasts too long to take out. I need somebody here. If you have a suggestion, let me know. Let me go ahead and show you my altar. This is my altar right here. These are the heroes that are available. If you have any suggestions, let me know. We'll try to solo it because that, that second attempt looked good. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. And until later, bye.